everyone. Most recently, over in the uh, GIMP users community on Google Plus, I was asked about uh, my GIMP interface. And basically, this is a theme. Of course, the layout is not part of the theme, it's just the colors. And unfortunately, when I'm running my um, recording software, uh, it does not allow me to uh, dock these dialogues in the places where I need to. Um, so I hopefully one of these days I can get that fixed. Uh, but anyway, what I wanted to do is show you how to uh, install a theme on GIMP on Windows. Uh, now Linux users have the uh, the option or privilege of setting up themes with their on on the Linux system itself, and then and then uh, GIMP will take on that theme that they have installed, which is really nice. Uh, but for Windows users. Um, it's not it's just not that simple um, it, I take that back it is it is easy but you have to go download the themes um, so anyway I'm gonna put a link in the description for uh, uh, some themes uh, so that you can go download those and I hear a, a lot of people asking about a dark theme uh, for GIMP. Uh, so anyway, uh, this particular theme is uh, what I did here is I went to edit and then preferences and uh, under the themes here uh, this particular theme is London Smoke uh, this is one I really like and then uh, the Prudence Dark is really nice uh, most of these uh, some of these other ones really don't work right uh, at least not on Windows 8 or on um, so I'm not sure why they don't uh, but this is the London Smoke and that's probably my favorite and then my second would be the Prudence Dark after you uh, have these themes installed, uh, of course you will go here to preferences and then choose your theme and then say OK. And then uh, for that, uh, for GIMP to take on that theme or display that theme, uh, you'll have to restart GIMP. Uh, so anyway, let me go ahead and show you how to uh, install a theme. The first thing you'll need to do is locate uh, your GIMP 2.8 folder. Uh, I am using Windows 8 and uh, I believe under Windows 7 uh, the GIMP 2.8 folder will be in a similar place and on XP I really don't remember uh, because it has been a long time since I've used XP but anyway if you're using Windows 7 or 8 uh, your GIMP 2.8 folder should be in a similar place so I'm just going to go to my C drive here and then I'll find my users folder and then uh, I'll go to my name and there should find uh, the GIMP 2.8 folder and I'll just open that and you can see here I have a folder inside there that's called uh, themes and that's where you will after you download uh, the theme files, uh, they may be a zip file, I don't re uh, really remember. There will be a link in the description anyway. And you can go download those themes and then move those theme files here uh, to the GIMP 2.8 and then the themes folder. And after you move uh, those themes into there, into your theme folder, you should be able to go into GIMP and then go to Edit, Preferences, and then Theme, and then choose your theme, and then say OK, and then restart GIMP, and your theme, uh, your theme on Windows GIMP should be changed. But anyway, that's a really quick, down and dirty uh, little tip for you link will be in the description for those themes and I really wish uh, that I could uh, show you how to customize uh, the layout here but my recording 
uh, software does prevent me from uh, doing that but anyway uh, that's about it so go get those themes and have a great day